The last stage we try to reach with the patient in our step-by-step -step training is to train the patient to ascend and descend stairs. We could start this training with ascending a step, like what we have here, and we could progress it to adding the raises to the step to increase the height and ultimately reach uh, the normal height uh, step. And uh, here, uh, we will apply the techniques we did before. So you shift the weight, and then you advance the leg forward. And throughout the whole technique, just like always in gait training, the therapist could be standing next to the patient to provide uh, either guiding manual contacts or resistance. So for example, I will resist you moving down, you know? Okay, so shift the weight to the right and advance the, or lower, but you will take a um, descent forward, okay? So advance the left leg to descend, okay? And now uh, descend with the other leg, okay? And we will apply it now on the step. After practicing step, uh, ascending and descending on the small step, we now uh, move into um, a real shaft of uh, several steps. And we could have the patient use the uh, rail if they need. And the therapist is around to provide either guiding movement or resistance on the purpose. Okay, so I will be behind you. And uh, take a step with the left. Okay, and resist it. I'll provide the resistance. Okay, now the right, okay, left, right, okay. So here, he's ascending one step at a time, and we can complete the whole shot. Next, we will practice ascending with uh, alternating steps. So here, we will put uh, one foot per step uh, at a time and ascend. Okay, so I will provide resistance. Take a step with the left leg, and resisting on the pelvis. Now with the right, I move it up a step. Okay, good. Now left. Okay. And after we finish this training, we do the same with moving down the steps. 